triumphant church. One flock and one shepherd. Those of you who follow me, who desire me, shall be of like mind in your thinking, speaking and actions. Then you will form a strong congregation although it is small in numbers. Then my spirit will take effect in you and, being permeated by my spirit, you will be able to speak for me and my kingdom. And your words will ignite, for you give evidence of them yourselves with your actions which express your thoughts and your will. Unity shall reign in my congregation because all are living in the same truth and all must be united with me by love and therefore form a great soul which I call my church. I will always be present in this congregation, and when my word is preached it is I who speaks through the speaker. And this is the church against which even the gates of hell shall not prevail, for if I am present in it myself the adversary's activity will remain unsuccessful. This is the church which will triumph at the end of the days, for it embraces the flock whose shepherd I am. It will only be one flock and one shepherd. It will comprise people of all denominations who have liberated themselves from all external appearances and who, due to their eagerness of living to please me, are in intimate contact with me. And I will graze my sheep, in evergreen pastures, where no cliffs, no thorns and no pits exist anymore, I will be in the midst of my own in the paradise of the new earth for then there will be no separation between us anymore, my sheep will not flee from me any longer, they will not leave their shepherd, for they love me and don't want to be without me again. You only have a little time left and should strive to enlarge your congregation, my true church, and therefore you should exemplify the right way of life to them, you shall give love and through love try to gain the children of the world who are oblivious of the strength of love. Give them much love, so that it will kindle the flame in their hearts, so that they will get to know the pleasure of giving and of happiness, so that they will join you and thus also seek to make contact with me. Be a good example to them and try to motivate them into doing the same in order to test the strength of love and of faith. Show them the path to me, draw their attention to the right relationship with me, explain to them that they must see their father in me to whom they must submit like children in order to be elevated to true children who shall come into the father's inheritance. And even if you can only gain a few it will nevertheless be a great merit to you, since the good shepherd delights in every sheep that once was lost and comes back to him and thus I will also bless everyone who helps me to increase my congregation before the final end has come. Amen.